Hello, Margaret Toomey Public School Ravens students, uh, staff, and families. It's Mr. Wilson with this week's Margaret Toomey Public School Principal Update. And today I'm from somewhere awesome. This is a little place called Jackfish Bay. And behind me in that direction is the ghost town, ooh, ghost town of Jackfish, Ontario, which is about 20 kilometers on our side of Terrace Bay. There's a great beach, there are cool rocks to explore, there's all kinds of natural beauty that sometimes we might take for granted. So as you've noticed, I try and get out on these videos to get some fresh air and share some of my favorite places with you. Uh, last week was a great week. I mean, every week at Margaret Toomey Public School is a great week. But last week was especially great because um, a lot of things came together in a really good way. And I want to start off by giving a shout out to Mrs. Twants and Miss Critch for the incredible neurodiversity board that uh, we have in the main hallway. Now, for those of you who don't know what the term neurodiversity means, it's referring to students who uh, understand the world or communicate or see and sense things a little bit differently than most people. So that includes uh, people with a diagnosis of um, the autism spectrum, which could include a diagnosis of autism or another condition called Asperger's syndrome. There are students who are sensitive to certain senses like noise or lights or even rapid music. And this is an opportunity for us to recognize all of the unique qualities that make our Ravens cool. And parents and community members cool and interesting and diverse too. So neuro means your brain and your mind and diverse means different. So we're all about celebrating how our brains work differently because if we were all the same, my goodness, the world would just not be as interesting as it is with all of these unique differences. So Ravens, let's celebrate all of our friends who are different than we are. Let's champion them outside and in the community and in the school as well. Let's be friends and good schoolmates to make the world a better place that accepts everyone for who they are. So that's what neurodiversity is all about. And I'm excited to share some of the pictures from the incredible neurodiversity display. Uh, I don't wanna give any spoilers because it wasn't quite done on Friday, but my goodness, it looks really, really cool. The other cool thing about people coming together um, is our custodial staff. I don't know if you know, but Margaret Toomey Public School has a very small but mighty custodial staff. And honestly, uh, Cheryl and Sherry and Kelsey and Lena are incredible. Um, they work tirelessly to keep our school clean and safe. And like most places right now, we're dealing with staff shortages. So thank you for our incredible custodial staff for all you do, it's awesome. The other thing that's coming together is just my own familiarity with the school. Um, I love jumping into classrooms. I'm trying to celebrate every class on our social media, but for families, man, oh man, what an awesome learning environment our kids get to attend every day. It really is awesome. And I'm kind of pumped about the last two and a half months of the school year because I have a sneaking suspicion more cool stuff is going to happen. For example, some of our primary classes in May are going to be going to Bigtgong Nishnabeg to learn with the friends at the Badabin Healing Lodge. Um, there are opportunities to go outside. We even have Freezy Fridays coming up soon. So stay tuned, my Ravens friends, because this is such an incredible time of year, especially with this nice weather. Let's take a look at this view again, because my goodness, what a ridiculously awesome April Saturday. A um, Couple of announcements before we wrap up though. This Thursday, April the 18th is picture retake day, and it's also a day uh, for the grade eight grad pictures. Information was sent home, or you can find it on our social media or by calling the school at 807-229-3050 and Mrs. Lackey will get you the information you need to know. 
Last but not least is Friday. This Friday, April the 19th, is a professional activity day where staff are going to be learning about Indigenous ways of knowing and sharing. We're going to be hearing from some incredible speakers to equip our staff with ensuring that we're reaching all parts of Canadian history and all of the students who come into our classroom to make sure that they know about the rich and incredible Indigenous history that makes Canada, Canada. Um, so lots of good stuff coming down the pipeline, but in the interim, let's just enjoy this beach. It's almost beach season, Ravens. So I'll leave you with this. Have yourselves a fantastic short week and take care of yourselves and take care of each other.